Konnichiwa. Welcome to Learn Japanese with Masa Sensei. This is episode 135. Today, in this episode, we will learn about expressions for request. Now, let's go. We learned about imperative form. So, let's say I am a female or a male and I ask my friend, lend me a book. In this case, we will use te form. So, lend a book is hon wo kashimasu. Hon wo kashimasu. We will change kashimasu into te form. Kashite. Kashite. In a casual conversation, we normally drop all the particles. Therefore, it will become hon kashite. Hon kashite. This means lend me the book. So, both female and male can use this expression. There's another expression for lend me the book. We can say, Hon kashite kure. Hon kashite kure. This is specifically used when the speaker is a male. So, if it's a female, we don't really use this expression. So, te form plus kure is used among guys. These expressions are imperative form. Therefore, we can use for close friends. However, if you want to be a little polite, we have another expression. s Can you lend me the book? We can say, Hon kashite kureru. Hon kashite kureru. So, te form plus kureru. It means, Can you lend me the book? This expression is much more polite than Hon kashite or Hon kashite kure. Another way to say is, Hon kashite kure nai? Hon kashite kure nai? It is the same meaning. It means, Can you lend me the book? So we can use, Hon kashite kure ru? Or, Hon kashite kure nai? For example, Can you show me your homework? Homework is, Shukudai, Shukudai. To show something is, Misemas, Misemas. テフォンプラスくれる will be 宿題見せてくれる宿題見せてくれる Another expression is 宿題見せてくれない宿題見せてくれない Can you lend me some money? Money is お金お金 To lend something is 貸します貸します So テフォンプラスくれる will become お金貸してくれるお金貸してくれる Another expression is お金貸してくれないお金貸してくれない So we can use テフォンプラスくれる or テフォンプラスくれない So you can use テフォンプラスくれる or テフォンプラスくれない when you want to make requests. There are other expressions for request. For example, テフォンプラスもらえる And テフォンプラスもらえない These expressions are telling my request and asking the other party in a question form at the same time. もらいます is to receive. However, in this case, we will use the potential form, which is もらえます。So here we cannot say てもらう or てもらわない。These expressions have to be potential form. テフォンプラスもらえる and テフォンプラスもらえない。So let's use the same examples. Can you lend me the book? It will become 本貸してもらえる本貸してもらえる Another expression is 本貸してもらえない本貸してもらえない Can you show me your homework? It becomes 宿題見せてもらえる宿題見せてもらえる。Another expression is 宿題見せてもらえない。宿題見せてもらえない。Can you lend me some money? お金貸してもらえる。お金貸してもらえる。Another expression is お金貸してもらえない。お金貸してもらえない。When you want to make a request to someone in a higher position than you or someone older than you, we have other expressions. So, for example, please lend me the book. We have learned please do something, which is te f o n plus kudasai. 
本を貸してください。本を貸してください。This means please send me the book. If you want to say, could you please lend me the book to someone in a higher position than you or someone older, we can use テフォーム plus もらえますか or テフォーム plus もらえませんか It will become 本を貸してもらえますか本を貸してもらえますか or 本を貸してもらえませんか本を貸してもらえませんか So these expressions are telling my request and asking the other party in a question form at the same time. We have other variations. So when you want to say, could you please lend me the book? We can also use te form plus くださいますか or te form plus くださいませんか or te form plus いただけますか or テフォンプラスいただけませんかくださいますか is the honorific form of くれますかくれますかくださいませんか is the honorific form of くれませんかくれませんかいただけますか is the honorific form of もらえますかもらえますか and いただけませんか It's the honorific form of もらえませんかもらえませんか So again, we have to be careful. We cannot say いただきますか We have to say いただけますか So we have to make it to potential form. Same goes for いただけませんか This is potential form. We cannot say いただきませんか So, all these expressions mean, could you please do something? When you talk to someone in a higher position than you or someone older than you, it will become impolite to say, Tai des, I want to do something, to someone who is in a higher level or someone older than you. We will actually use causative form plus te fo plus kudasai instead. For example, I would like to send an email to our client. Client is お客さん。お客さん。I want to send an email. In a normal form, it becomes メールを送りたいです。メールを送りたいです。If you say メールを送りたいです to your boss, it sounds a bit impolite. Instead, we will use positive form plus Te form plus kudasai. Another example. Because I am not feeling well, I would like to go back home. I am not feeling well is 具合が悪いです。具合が悪いです。Because we have many expressions, but let's use ので。ので means because, but this is used in a formal situation. So, 具合が悪いので。I want to go back home. In a normal sentence, we say, 帰りたいです。帰りたいです。However, it's a bit rude to say, 帰りたいです to your boss. Therefore, we will change this into causative form, change to te form, and put together with ください。It becomes, 具合が悪いので、帰らせてください。具合が悪いので、帰らせてください。Today, we learned many expressions for a request. When you want to say, can you do something to your friend, we can use te kureru or te kurenai. Other expressions that we can use for friend is te moraeru or te moraenai. When you want to make a request to someone in a higher position than you or someone older than you, we can say te moraemasu ka? Te moraemasen ka? てくださいますかてくださいませんかていただけますかていただけませんか And finally, when you want to say, I want to do this to a superior, we will use causative form, change into te form, and put together with ください。So this is all for today. Thank you very much for listening. I hope it was helpful for you. 
If you're interested in Japanese grammars, please check out my YouTube channel. The link is in the description. I also have Facebook page and Instagram page, so please follow them as well. I will see you in the next episode. Arigatou gozaimashita. Bye bye.